Hawaii's primary election one month from today. And if you're still trying to make up your mind about the governor's race, well, two of the top candidates today offered more for you to consider. KITV4's Daryl Huff joining us with more on what they had to say. Daryl. Laura, you know, the Internet age gives candidates a chance to give voters a lot more information without the candidates' campaigns having to spend any money. So today, we got a jobs plan from Duke Iona and a plan for just about everything from Neil Abercrombie. I just love this. Abercrombie's 43-page A New Day in Hawaii is comprehensive, detailed, and ambitious, suggesting that years of energy and food dependence in Hawaii can be reversed into self-sufficiency. That's a great question. How we change the fund fundamental economics? You change the governor. That's what you do. You bring in a governor who's going to act on those premises. But really, how? The answer to that is, uh, is that we move to page 24. Duke Iona called a press conference to roll out his jobs creation plan. Although he won't say how many jobs it would create, it would mostly work by continuing the streamlining of government and regulation that has gone on under the legal administration. I believe we've made tremendous progress in the last eight years, and it's really a matter of, of uh, staying on top of it and making it, I believe, more transparent. Down the street from Iota headquarters, Party City is hiring, but a manager said the new jobs were delayed by permit delays. Iona offered business people with the same complaint. When you slow us down, you're slowing the state down because you're not allowing me to pay more taxes. Iona would set a deadline for bureaucrats handling the permits. And if you don't approve it within 30 days, it's deemed to be approved. And this is the model that I think we can all follow up on. Voters can read for themselves the details of these plans. They are on the candidates' websites, which you can get to quite easily from KITV.com. Laura. All right, thanks.